Hello, Bisha High School. Welcome to another at home workout. This is your high school PE staff. Say good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. For those of you who have been doing these workouts religiously and working hard, good for you. For those of you who have been taking it easy, this is stupid, it is never too late to start working out and feeling good about yourself and going all out. If you do these workouts, I promise you, you will see results. Okay, first things first, take those cell phones out, take a snapshot of your pedometer steps, put it back in your pocket so it's on your body. We have a one minute cardio warm up. Is everybody ready? Ready. ready. And five, four, three, two, and begin. Oh, this is <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Love. Look at Miss Jabonis with her perfect jump rope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Blackie. I see you, Blackie. So, our warm up is designed to speed up your heart rate, increase the blood flow going around your body, to make that cold spaghetti get loosey goosey. We have 40 seconds, PE teachers. You got this? I think my knees are squeaking again. <laughs> it's always good to have fun. We have 15 seconds, ladies and gentlemen. We got this. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, everybody. Okay, best time to stretch is when the blood's flowing. Legs are apart. Slide it down as low as you can go. This is called the bent over pose in yoga. And hopefully you're getting lower and lower each time you do this. Take your fingertips. Walk it out to flat palms. Legs are straight. Arms are straight. 50-50 weight. Take your head, let it go. And take a gorgeous deep breath in. Let's take our heads now, shoot it through our arms, and hold it there for three, two, one. Lock it out to push up position. Take a nice deep breath and drop your pelvis. Hold on. So you're gonna be doing tons of push-ups later. So we'll save it. Take another deep breath and try to drop your pelvis a little bit lower. If you can, look up a little, raise your chin. So three, two, one, get your toes ready. Give me one fluid motion. And up. Put all the weight on your heels. Adjust yourself, your hands, your feet if you need to. Take your head, force it through your arms toward your legs. Three, two, one. Lock it out to push up position again. Backs are straight. Take a gorgeous deep breath in. And drop the pelvis, blow it out. Hopefully you got a little bit lower. Take a gorgeous deep breath in. Drop your pelvis deeper. Raise your chin to the sky for three, two, one. Bring it to tabletop. Come out of your pose. Great job. Gotta love that warm up. Gotta love it. All right, guys. Good morning. So, listen. Today we are gonna do a little bit different set of workouts or ideas or principles. All right, we're gonna call this a momentary muscular fatigue. And each skill is not gonna be done in the way that we did this last couple of times high intensity interval training, but we're gonna do something called 4-1-4 protocol where you do all skills to the count of four. So whatever you do, whether it's a push-up, a squat, a good morning, bicep curls or the extensions for your triceps, everything will be down to a count of four, all right? 30 seconds on, followed by 30 seconds off continuously. We're gonna hit every single body part today including cardio, and finish up with your ab at the very end. All right? You guys ready? Yeah. Here we go. So the first thing we're gonna do is go to squat. You notice, 
But one thing I tell you really fast is this. Squat, you're gonna go nice and slow. Two, three, four, hold for a second and go back up, nice and easy. All right, just like this, don't go yet, here we go, ready? We're gonna go in three, two, oh, sorry, eight seconds. And four, three, go in squats first, 30 seconds on, 30 off, you can go with weights or no weights. And up, two, three, four, and down, two, three, four, hold, up, Two, three, four, and down again. You don't stop. Three, four, hold for a second and go back up. As you're doing your squats, down, two, keep make sure your hips go right below your knees and go back up. And you are done. Good job, guys. 30 second break. The difference now is as you do each skill is slower, you should feel a lot more heat in a muscle that you really are impacting. To go work out, okay? Skill number two, it's called a good morning. You can go with weights or no weights. Your knees are straight. Feet short, do it apart. Hands go out, you pause, and go back in. You should feel a stretch behind your knees. All right, here we go. All right. Pull it out, three, four, hold it. In, two, three, four, and go. Down, two, three, four, hold it. And go back, two, three, four, and go again, out, two, three, four, keep it going, just like that, very good, you can go with the weights, on the weights, keep it going, two more, if you can, probably one more, excellent, push up, okay, your choice, I right, go push up on your knees, all right, I'll demo first, before you guys go, same thing too, back is flat, hands on the floor, all right, you're gonna go down, two, three, four, hold it. Don't touch the floor. Up, two, three, four. You will notice you are shaking a lot more. That's okay. All right, you guys? Yep. Six right. seconds. You can't come back, bro. And down, two, three, four, hold. Up, two, three, four. Down, two, three, four, hold. Up, Two, three, four, and down again. Two, three, four, hold. Up, two, three, four, and down. Two, three, four, you hold it. Up, two, three, four, and stop. If you notice, you're doing a lot less skills, but the intensity is increased because you're going a lot slower throughout the entire range of motion. Okay, keep that in mind. All right, bent over row, quite simple. One knee down, just like this. Let the weight hang. Let the weight hang, uh, hang by your knee and go up slowly. Two, three, four. Hold it. Down. Two, three, four. You can do one hand or two. Your choice. All right. You notice this pencil line has a weight. If you have a weight, use one. It's really good. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Your choice. All right. Mr. Blockman, this is the bonus, Mr. Love. We're using a one gallon of water. That's eight pounds. Once again, one hand, one ball, your choice. In three seconds, we are going 30 on, 30 off. There are other options. I'll tell you about them at the very end. All right? Switching sides. So, bent over row, now you're going to push press. All right, push press, you can go with both. If you'd like to, both weights, up, two, three, four, down, two, three, hold, up, two, nice and slow, all right? And here we go, guys. Press the weight up, three, four. Make sure as you're pressing the weight, okay, your hands are right on your knees. Don't go two, four, four, it's gonna go above your head. Nice and slow. Alright, you know it's just going a lot slower. Alright, here we go. And up, two, three, four, and down, two, three, four. Hold it. Press two, three, four, and down, two, three, and stop. 
you may only get to four or five scales. That's quite all right, stick with it. All right, we want you to feel the difference. High pull, all right, for your back muscle, same exact thing too. Grab the weights or no weights. Basically what you're gonna do is side view, go right from here, bring the weight right below your chest. The elbows go out, hold it down, two, three, four, and up, two, three, four, hold it here, and go back down. Ready, here we go, and up, two, three, four, hold, down, two, three, four, and up, two, three, four. If you notice, you don't really rest on any part of the actual pull. You're going up, you're going down. At one point, you pause for a second, it's quite all right. You want you to understand what it feels like to overcome the inertia when the move is done, you go again. Three I seconds. Okay, now next one is bicep curl. If you go one hand or both at the same time, same idea. You're gonna go up, two, three, four. Hold it here for a second. Go back down, two, three, four. Two hands, one at a time. You choose. Five seconds. Grab the way that's good for you. Oh yeah, Mr. Bonus. Up, and up. Two, three, Double four, hold, down, two, three, four, and up, two, three, four, hold at the top, down, two, three, four, and up, two, three, four. Now, as you do your bicep curl, it's always good to maybe put your feet about short width apart so you're comfortable. Whatever you, want to whatever you prefer, go with that. Three seconds. Now we're going to go into tricep, to the opposite bicep. I'm going to go into tricep, and I'm going to grab on the weight. You got to step forward, put your elbow right below your armpit on the side, look forward, and bring your weight out. So your elbow is extended completely, and go back in nice and slow. Count to four. All right, up, two, three, four. Hold it, down, two, three, and four. Ready, and go, extend. Two, three, four, hold, down, two, three, four. And for it to look very easy, I promise you, if you don't want to go down the water, it's a half, it's pretty difficult. Alright? You don't see this, but each seat you as a bar is shaking just a little bit, and that's completely okay. Alright? And keep in mind, you go on to down, you go. Two seconds, and try this. Hear that? I just love tricep is shaking, he's holding it up, all right? It's a good move. All right, guys, now we're gonna go back to the first spot again, all right? We just did the entire body, all right? Your quads, your hammies, pecs, thigh tries, deltoids, your back muscles, all right? Now we're gonna go back to the top and go with the squats. With the weight or without the weight, 30 on, 30 off, good choice. All right, round two, everyone. Round two. Down, two. Hold it, up, two, three, four. You can hold the weight whichever way you want to. By your side, in front of you, over your shoulders, no choice, all right? As you do each skill, you should feel heat right in your quads. And one more, guys, go up, up two, three, four. And we down. By the way, very good point with Mr. Love Discuss the Magno. You guys make sure you are breathing throughout the entire movement. If you hold your breath, you might not last long. Alright, keep that in mind. Go back to the bonus. Weight with no weight. Keep short of the part. Go back out. Hold the weight. Go back in. You feel straight in your butt, in your hands. Alright? Round two. Three. Now we're going to 
push-ups. All right. One of those moves that looks easy, but as soon as you go slower, it's a lot more difficult. All right. If you want to modify, you can. Use your knees. Take a little break. Your choice. But keep in mind, you're going slowly, and you want to feel what it feels like. Help come the inertia as you're going down for a push-up press. Two, one, and down, two, three, four, you hold it, and up, two, three, four, and down, two, three, four, you hold it, up, two, three, four, I promise you, this looks easy, at home if you're practicing going along, it's pretty difficult, keep it going, if you have to, modify, modify. How you doing over there, Devonis? Let's go! Yeah, Miss Council, man. One more. Down, two, three, and we are done. Okay? All right, guys. Bend over, bro. And fatigue is the right word because the muscles slowly start to feel tired. Did you guys hear that? Miss Lovis said fatigue. Okay, muscle fatigue. This is exactly what you're going for. You're shooting for a complete failure. And this situation is completely appropriate and right. Yeah, you're going to do the other arm here. Right. All right. If you only did one arm before, switch arms. You're doing both, go both again, nice and slow. And up, two, three, four, hold it. Down, two, three, four. If you notice this motion here resembles you starting a lot lower, but you're going a lot slower. Should've done this one, nice and easy, breathe through the entire motion. Natural breathing. Got three seconds. Right, but the rest is dead. Good job, guys. 30 seconds off. Now we're doing a push press. You can go on the side this way, push press. You can put your feet slightly in steps for a for better balance. Your choice. Shoulder width apart. Whatever you do, make sure your hands are right by your ears and press it up over your head and you hold the weight at the very top and go back down. All right? You're moving the weight the entire time throughout the entire range of motion. Right. Three seconds. And push. Two, three, four. You hold it down. Two, three, four. And again, push. Two, three, four. Hold down. Two. You guys looking great. Down is up in my head as well. How we feeling, B.E. Sam? Let's great. go, console back. Muscular strength. Push press, okay? Yeah, excellent, guys. Now you're gonna do the opposite. All right, push, usually pull. All right, so you're gonna do a high pulls. Put the weights, be back, knee traps, all right? Very easy skill if you have a barbell at home. Go to the barbell, you're gonna go right below your chin, elbows go out, right over here, hold it. You go back down slowly. If you wanna go with one hand, you can. Or two hands, choose it, weight, no weight. What it feels good to you. Do this. Two, one, and go. Hold the weight up, elbows go out to the side, let your chin, go back down. Three, and four, and up. Two, three, four, down. Two, three, four. Just like that, guys, keep going. Again, you might not get to number eight, ten, that's fine. All right, but at the very least, you understand the idea of what we're trying to, uh, to do here and teach you here, okay? Five seconds. Nice and curl, you go single arm, switch it up, two arms together, your choice. All right, grab both. Yeah. Grab both ways. Yeah. See that? This one's good. Shake it a little bit. Yeah, that's good too. Yeah, that's good too. You got 10 seconds, bicep nice curl. Right over here. All right, get ready, people. Put the weight right on your chair. Everybody, almost done. And up to. Three, four, and down. Two, three, four, and up. Two, three, four, hold it. Down. Two, three, four. What you guys don't see is I see the eye of a tiger in every teacher's eyes, all right? A really a focused laser, spot on, all right? Keep in mind, breathe throughout the entire range of motion nice and easy, all right? Six seconds. Oh, yeah. 
Open the muscles. Down. Now it's bicep. Now we're doing a tricep. Extension. All right. If you did on one arm before, switch your hands. Do the exact same thing going up. If you've hurt this a lot before, he said his tricep is shaking a little bit. Great. That's what you want to feel. And some heat. Last set I did left arm this time. I'm going to do right arm this time. Me too, Blackie. I'm going to go both. Are you? Why not? Why not? <laughs> Why not? Ready? Up, down, two, three, four. Hold it. Down, two, three, four, and up. Two, three, four. You're going great, guys. Keep going. You got 12 seconds to go. 12 seconds to go. Tricep. So listen, so now we just did two sets of each, the overall body workout. Now we're going to go into two minutes of cardio, okay? So make sure you get some sort of jump rope, space around your house, bedroom, kitchen, whatever you want. We're going for two minutes of cardio. I'll start with jumping jacks and then I'll do that. I'll jump around. I'm going to follow. It's two minutes? Two minutes. All right. Half a minute for Mr. Hall. Or maybe 15 seconds. You notice when you work out together at some point, you're going to be completely in sync. Alright, I want to go to Mr. Bonus. Elbows, elbows, elbows. Guys, we got half a minute. Keep it going, keep it going. I'm gonna jump this to Blackford too. Last round the chin. Elbow bump. Elbow bump. My knees get into Mr. Love's skin. Uh oh, Lord Top checked in the way, huh? done half a minute off so listen we're gonna finish up now with the last skill all right abs for one minute well, until you fail all right so you choose whichever ab exercise you want to do it's up to you I tell you, you don't hear this, but as I'm next to each person, everyone's breathing naturally. A little bit heavier, but naturally. So what do you do with the curl ups? Don't hold your breath. Just keep it going. What was I thinking choosing this one? <laughs> Done. I love it. 
All right, guys, listen. Good work. Teachers. That's it, one minute. One minute. We are good. We are good. We are good. So, listen, so the idea is quite simple. Okay, we did today an idea of print what's called momentary muscular fatigue or muscle failure. Okay, each skill was 30 on, 30 off. If you feel sprite, do the thing all over again if you want to. All right, ideally, if you can. So we would do this for about a minute on and then 30 seconds off, all right? But the idea here is that you want to feel the actual heat of the burn until your muscle fails, all right? Here we go, guys. Great job. I'm going to pull Borkowski.